Alice. Smoke some I grad sent on West Malone. Grads, believe hot grabber. <laughs> I could take it to Jamaica, introduce it to I some I grad ganja. <laughs> <laughs> and you could smoke all you want, believe me, so I you're not gonna catch you cancer. No. And every night about to three dawn, so make you kick off your clocks or your sneakers. Yeah. Hey, this is Alpha with JamaicaMax.com, where we not only offer the best ganja tours in Jamaica, but also custom vacations for people from all over the world interested in the land of wood and water and the many beautiful things there are to see in this jewel of the Caribbean. Jamaica has lots of natural beauty for the adventurers to explore, including some of the clearest freshwater rivers and waterfalls, such as Roaring River, where you can watch crystal clean drinking water burst out of the ground with a raging force, or take a dip in the healing waters of these natural mineral springs. Jamaica offers some of the most unique plants and flowers in nature, like the mimosa, which is sensitive to touch and was used by slave drivers to capture runaway slaves or as an herbal remedy for... Jamaica is an island surrounded by the bright blue Caribbean Sea, and we offer tours from the four major cities. Let's start with our home base of Negril, the capital of Casual, where your day may begin early with you watching the sunrise from your hotel room as you sip a cup of Blue Mountain coffee at breakfast before you take a short trip to Long Bay Beach amidst the towering palms for a leisure stroll on the seven mile long white sand beaches of Negril. Enjoy the sun and water sports, such as snorkeling, where you will be delighted by the huge variety of sea life you see, including starfish and sea snails, all in knee-deep water just a few feet from the shore. Once you've had enough sun and sand, we can take a short ride to the Royal Palm Reserve, where you can enjoy the nature walk and beautiful landscapes of the largest stand of Royal Palm trees left in the world. The park is a wonderful day tour where you can view some of the pristine natural environments of Jamaica from the observation tower when you enjoy a walk down the boardwalk where you will see rare wildlife like the Jamaican duck. Or we can head over to Charles Swaby's Black River Safari for a real Jamaican wildlife experience that takes us on a pontoon boat down the historic Black River and into the wetlands and mangroves of backwoods Jamaica where we will see birds like the egret and hopefully the very rare Jamaican crocodile swimming on the surface in search of its next meal or possibly at rest in the shade of the mangroves trees with some birds. From here we travel on to the YS Falls which is a centuries old plantation and horse breeder down the south coast of Jamaica that is home to one of the largest and most majestic waterfalls in the entire country. And of course, no trip to McGrill is complete without an afternoon at Rick's Cafe. For the absolute best sunsets and crowds of tourists enjoying the cliff dive of the live music each and every day. McGrill is by far our favorite destination in Jamaica because it offers a true Jamaican experience and just about everything you can find here, from the great outdoors to some of the finest places indoors. And there are more tours to party from this location. But we do offer services in four major cities. And Montego Bay, or Mo Bay, is our next stop. With more high-end resorts and shopping than the rest of Jamaica. If that's what you're looking for, we can arrange it. But on this trip, we're sticking to the many natural adventures. And our first stop is the Rocklands Bird Sanctuary. Where they've been feeding endemic birds like the Dr. Bird for over 40 years. And every afternoon, you could sit down in a chair and hand-feed these hummingbirds while perched in your hand. Rafting down the Martha Bray River is a splendid and relaxing way to spend an afternoon with a guided tour down one of Jamaica's longest rivers, where you will pass through the beautiful surrounding forest on a bamboo raft with your Jamaican guide pointing out the local flora. 
Our next destination is Ocho Rios, which is a major cruise port and home to the number one attraction in all of Jamaica with Duns River Falls, which is by far the most beautiful waterfall in the country and the perfect place to spend the day with friends and family for an exhilarating hike up the waterfall or a nice day at the beach where the Duns River meets the Caribbean Sea. After Dunn's River, we can head over to the Cranbrook Flower Forest for one of the best collections of flowers and rare plants you'll ever see with species like the Heliconia and Jade Vine with its very unique turquoise flowers. Cranbrook is possibly one of the best places to see the many wonderful flowering plants and trees in Jamaica and the river walk is a pure delight as you head towards the river head and once again witness pure, clean water bursting from the ground with raging force. Last stop on our journey is Kingston, the capital city and stomping grounds of the most famous Jamaican, Robert Nesta, Bob Marley, where one of the most popular attractions is the Bob Marley Museum at his former home on Hope Road, where you can still see many of his things preserved as they were when he was alive, as well as a wonderful collection of news articles and other memorabilia. There are no photos inside of the museum, so you'll have to go there to see all that's available. There's much more to see in Kingston, including Tough Gong Records and many other wonderful things, but on this trip, we're headed up into the John Crow, Blue Mountains, and the Hollowell Park, where you can spend an evening overlooking Kingston Harbor and the lights of the largest city while camping near the Mountain Peak, which provides breathtaking vista views of the surrounding mountains and the town below, or you can hike through the rainforest to the tallest waterfall in Jamaica. Jamaica offers a variety of extreme sports, such as scuba diving with tropical fish. If scuba diving isn't extreme enough for you, then maybe you'll try your luck spearfishing with some local Jamaican fishermen. Of course, Jamaica is the birthplace of reggae music, and we have the hookups for backstage and VIP access to the top reggae concerts. Look, 
Music is a huge part of Jamaican culture, and when you're ready to experience it, let us plan the perfect vacation for you and your guests, and we'll build a custom itinerary to make the most of your vacation in paradise. Jamaica truly is a special place, filled with the wondrous colors of nature and the beauty of life all around us. And with a little planning, you can enjoy all there is to see, smell, and taste, fruits and produce, to blooming flowers, wild birds, and butterflies galore. For your next vacation, check us out online at www.jamaicamax.com.